Okay, uh, I'm going to tell you the story of my cat, Cinder, that died. So, we got a rescue kid, I think, like, before I was born, and, and he, I mean, he, he was a black kitty, and he, uh, he, um, used to, like, pant like a dog when he was a kid. It was kind of funny to my dad, because my dad was put, used to have a laser. They, ch they chased, they chased, Cinder chased it, and it had, my dad laughed, I think when, I think when, uh, when he panted, and he got a little old, and he actually, uh, this is my cat Bella. She's like probably uh thirteen years old. Her birthday's coming soon, April first. Anyway, he he used to bite Bella's neck, but Bella was okay. She he she just got angry at him. But one day he started uh me and my dad noticed he started uh going downstairs a lot and me and my dad were like this is weird so uh so um we decided to give him this special food cause we thought he was sick I mean he didn't eat it that much he probably finished it the first time he was or down here or like the like third time he was down there then he, like the fourth time he been down there he didn't really eat a lot of it so we had to take him to the vet and yeah and there was a dog and he was like a little pouncy but he was okay i kind of got bothered but he was like fine anyway they set cinder off at the table and the and we drove home and I kept looking at the car seat because he we, when we went to the bed he was there he was there in the cat cage and there there was the cat cage there and I was like getting a little sad then. He felt a teeny bit better, not like a lot better, but a teeny bit, weeny bit better. And he, when we went home, we, and when we went home, I was a little happy. But he still went downstairs. Finally, at night, he came upstairs, and I think he was like at, at like 4 a.m. or 3 a.m. and he like came up on the bed when I woke up he had a seizure it was kind of like sneezing but then he was like freaking out and he and then he, we had to you know we had to uh, we had to he was like freaking out and everything and he had a couple seizures we had a couple seizures in the living room, so we had to vi uh, visit the vet again, like again, Dad. And then he said yes again, and he told me what a seizure was, and because I thought he would have had a bad dream. Like this is when I was nine years old, and uh, we just brought him to the vet again, and a couple days later. My dad said he couldn't make it, and I was crying inside, and I felt really sad, and he was, he was very special to me.
I said of this letter of wanting to get a chicken. So I followed her, and uh, that's where my love for cooking was born. I'm getting a chicken, and yeah, and of getting a chicken, and I really want a chicken. Our new cat is called Josephine, and just we, feel the same way. we call her head a peanut head. And Bella has a little bit of a walnut head. That's why I call her a walnut head. And she's very cute. They're both very cute. And yeah. There were a little Buzz Balls. Even Cinder was. And he's like my number one little kitty. The uh, Cinder. And he used to be out all the time, and he, when he grew up, he went wow, 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 wow. And yeah, he was very funny. Oops. Bye.